Bandim Health Project is a field station in Guinea-Bissau in West Africa that covers a population of around 200,000 people with regular home visits in a so-called health and demographic surveillance system. Uh, in a country that has no road names or house numbers, we've mapped the areas we study. Uh, we have given all the houses a house number and we've conducted censuses to capture every individual living in the households. And on top of that, we have regular home visits where we every three to four months visit all the uh, households where there are women of the fertile age and children uh, to capture all new pregnancies, all new deliveries, and also to follow up on the health of children, uh, their risk of infections, hospitalizations, and of course their risk of, of death also. In a system like that, we can do what nobody else has done before we started doing it, namely evaluating the effect of all the different interventions that are implemented on the overall health. And during this process, we've discovered that almost all the interventions we study do not have the anticipated effect on overall health. Sometimes we saw interventions could have a much more beneficial effect on overall health than was anticipated based on their uh, specific effects. But sometimes we've also discovered that interventions which were thought to have a very beneficial effect, in fact, did not have that beneficial effect or even had a negative effect. 